Hello everyone. To date, more than 1 million different insects are known through science. Most of these creatures do not pose any danger to humans, but some of them have very strong venom or are carriers of deadly diseases. And today I offer you a look at the most dangerous insects, which it is better never to touch. Let's go! Mosquito. Mosquito. It may seem strange, but the most dangerous insects in the world are mosquitoes. More than 3 million people die each year because of them. It is not the insect's bite that is dangerous, but the diseases it can transmit during its meal. During the bite, diseases such as filariasis, encephalitis, yellow fever, bartonellosis, malaria, and many others can enter the victim's blood. And even if the insect is not a vector, it can become one by drinking the blood of an infected host. It is noteworthy that only females attack, while males are completely harmless and participate only in reproduction. For mosquitoes, humans are the most accessible blood donors, which is why they become victims of these dangerous diseases. Cone Snail This snail is an active predator and one of the most poisonous creatures on the planet. Just one drop of venom produced by this marine organism can kill up to 20 people. Inside the shell of the snail is a kind of proboscis, in which is hidden a tooth, connected to the poisonous glands of the mollusk. Once in the victim, a powerful paralyzing poison is injected through the tooth and the snail immobilizes the victim for further eating. Usually cone snail hunts for small fish and worms, but it is also dangerous for humans, because it lives in shallow water and is often found in the coastal area. Its beautiful cone-shaped shell beckons people to take it as a souvenir. In this case, the snail begins to defend itself and sting a person with its venom, from which there is no antidote. Spanish Fly In terms of biology, the Spanish fly is a beetle in the blister beetle family that has nothing in common with the fly. These beetles have to go through seven stages of maturation before they become an adult. When basically most insects require about four stages. After hatching from the egg, the little larva climbs to the nearest flower, where it waits for the bee. If she is lucky, she will catch on to her body hairs and fly off with her to the nest. The unsuspecting bee leaves the parasite in its nest, where it feeds on honey and bee larvae until it passes its remaining five stages and matures. But in addition to their parasitic lifestyle, their cover, the hemolymph, contains a venom called cantharidin, which in contact with humans causes severe burns, deep sores on the skin. There have been cases where people have eaten the insect in the hope of getting a healing effect, but nothing good has come of it, burns of internal organs and hemorrhage led only to excruciating death. But cattle are most susceptible to this taxidermis, which eat the plant along with this beetle during grazing. Karakurt Karakurt is translated from the Turkic language as a black insect. But also this spider is called the black widow because the female eats the male immediately after mating. These small spiders have a very strong venom. If a person is not given first aid after being bitten, he can die. It is noteworthy that only the females are poisonous, and the males do not even have poison glands. Its pincers are so strong and powerful that they can pierce not only skin but even fingernails. The venom of the black widow causes a severe clinical syndrome, so an adult may not survive the consequences of the bite. In as little as half an hour, severe pain begins in the entire bitten area, which later engulfs the entire body. In addition, severe cramps, panic, and difficulty breathing occur. But the worst thing is that all this will have to endure for about 12 hours, because there is no effective way to relieve these symptoms. Scalapendra Heroes Scalapendra heros is considered the largest of the currently known millipedes. The size of this insect can reach 30 centimeters. Its habitat is in Mexico and the United States. The body of a scalapendra has about 23 segments, each with a pair of paws with sharp claws, and the claws of the front pair are connected with venomous glands. 
It is these that the millipede uses while hunting and protecting itself from predators. It hunts any creature no larger than its size, be it a lizard or frog, a snake or even a bird. The strong venom of Scalapendra heroes is lethal to most small animals and also very toxic to humans. Once ingested, it causes severe pain at the bite site, swelling, chills, fever, and general weakness. But there are also recorded cases where the bite of this insect has caused acute kidney failure and heart attack. However, it is useful to know that all the chemical elements that contain Scalapendra venom are destroyed under the influence of ethyl alcohol. Therefore, when bitten by a Scalapendra it is enough to slightly incise the wound and wash it with alcohol. Megalopygopercularis Megalopygopercularis is the most toxic butterfly caterpillar found in areas of South and Central America. It is hard to believe that this small, furry creature is capable of killing humans. Its torso is covered with long dense hairs, which at first glance poses no danger. However, it is better not to touch it, because under the hairs are hidden needles, which contain poison. These spines are very brittle and remain on the skin after touching, and at the place of the lesion there is a strong burning, redness, headache, vomiting and dizziness. Also venom megalopygopercularis capable of affecting the lymph nodes, causing severe abdominal pain and respiratory failure, up to and including death. Black Scorpion The black scorpion, or Androctonus, which is translated from the ancient Greek as man-killing, is one of the 25 most dangerous scorpion species in the world. Adults of this species can reach up to 13 centimeters in length. They lead a nocturnal lifestyle and hunt mainly insects and small vertebrates. I adult scorpion contains a powerful neurotoxin that kills a person in 7 hours. There are two varieties of venom, the first paralyzes and kills invertebrates, but such venom does no harm to humans. But the second type of poison can be deadly, it paralyzes the central nervous system, as well as the thoracic muscles of the body and causes cardiac arrest if the antidote is not administered in time. Tarantula Hawk This tropical wasp is the largest wasp in the world, which lives in North and South America. The insect gets this name because of its predilection for spiders. During reproduction, the wasp tracks a tarantula by scent and then paralyzes it with its venom in order to drag it to the nest and deposit its future offspring in the spider's body. Soon a larva emerges from the egg laid by the wasp, and it eats the tarantula alive from the inside. It is noteworthy that the hawk larva does not eat vital organs for a long time in order to keep the victim alive as long as possible. The wasp attacks humans only in self-defense, and its bite is the most painful of the entire insect kingdom, but other than severe pain, the venom of this insect is not fatal to humans. And that's all for me, thanks for watching, do not forget to subscribe to the channel, so as not to miss all the most interesting things that happen on our planet and beyond.